Today is October 14th, 2009, and today I'm going to show you the application called Orb. This is a free application that you can use to stream media to your cell phone or other computers within your home or anywhere on the internet. So, first of all, we're going to go to www.orb.com O-R-B dot com and here's Orb's website so now we're going to download the client because you have to install this server client program on your computer that will run down here in the system tray. Um, I'm going to go ahead and download the new version which does not support Xbox but you can download the older version that does support the Xbox. Um, it looks like they're still trying to make the new version work with Xbox. So I'm going to go ahead and run the application. You could save it to your desktop and then run the application then if you wanted to. Seems like my internet connection is a little slow today. Almost done here. Okay, so now we should get the installation for Orb. And if you get any warning messages about the firewall, go ahead and allow it. Installation screen, and you'll want to read through the terms of use, but it's pretty acceptable, so I'm going to go ahead and agree to that. And I'm just going to install in its default location. And since I've already got Orb installed, it's telling me it wants to uninstall the current version, which I'm not going to do that. I'm going to go ahead and cancel this install. 
but that is how you would be able to install that program on your computer. Once it's installed, it will start up down here in your system tray. Um, since I'm using Windows 7, it looks a little different than you might be used to. But here's the system tray icon. It's a little green ball that says Orb on it. So you can just right click on that and go to configure to configure your application. Now I just leave everything default here unless I'm having a problem. The only thing you're going to want to change here is on the media tab you're going to want to change to the folders where your media is stored on your computer. In this particular case I have all my media stored on my external hard drive. So all the paths point to the K drive. And it'll be unique for you whichever drive your media is on. So once you have that done you can just come in here on the advanced tab and there's multiple different options you can use. Uh, the UPnP is for streaming between computers on your home network. And then you'll want to go ahead and add your username once you create a username on Orb. So that's how you install the server client for Orb on your PC. The next video will be how to use it and access your media with your cell phone. Thanks for watching.